A gravistar is an object hypothesized in astrophysics as an alternative to the black hole theory by Pavel O. Mazur and Emil Matola. It results from assuming physical limitations on the formation of black holes. These limits, such as discrete length and time quanta Cronin, are an attempt to «modernize» the theory by incorporating quantum mechanics. The term «gravistar» is a portmanteau of the words «gravitational vacuum star». Topic. Structure The notion of gravistars builds on Einstein's theory of general relativity and imposes a universal, smallest size, that is known to exist according to well-accepted quantum theory. This size is known as the Planck length, and is derived using the speed of light, Planck's constant and the gravitational constant. Quantum theory says that any scale smaller than the Planck length is unobservable and meaningless to physics and physicists. This limit can be imposed on the wavelength of a beam of light so as to obtain a limit of blue shift that the light can undergo. However, in the presence of an event horizon the blue shift diverges. In the original formulation by Mazur and Matola, gravistars contain a central region featuring a p equals rho false vacuum or dark energy, a thin shell of p equals rho perfect fluid, and a true vacuum p equals rho equals zero exterior. The dark energy-like behavior of the inner region prevents collapse to a singularity and the presence of the thin shell prevents the formation of an event horizon, avoiding the infinite blue shift. The inner region has thermodynamically no entropy and may be thought of as a gravitational Bose-Einstein condensate. Severe red shifting of photons as they climb out of the gravity well would make the fluid shell also seem very cold, almost absolute zero. In addition to the original thin shell formulation, gravistars with continuous pressure have been proposed. These objects must contain anisotropic stress. Externally, a gravistar appears similar to a black hole, it is visible by the high energy radiation it emits while consuming matter, and by the Hawking radiation it creates. Astronomers observe the sky for X rays emitted by infalling matter to detect black holes. A gravistar would produce an identical signature. It is also possible, if the thin shell is transparent to radiation, that gravistars may be distinguished from ordinary black holes by different gravitational lensing properties as null geodesics may pass through. Mazur and Matola suggest that the violent creation of a gravistar might be an explanation for the origin of our universe and many other universes, because all the matter from a collapsing star would implode through the central hole and explode into a new dimension and expand forever, which would be consistent with the current theories regarding the Big Bang. This new dimension exerts an outward pressure on the Bose-Einstein condensate layer and prevents it from collapsing further. Gravistars also could provide a mechanism for describing how dark energy accelerates the expansion of the universe. One possible hypothesis uses Hawking radiation as a means to exchange energy between the parent universe and the child universe, and so cause the rate of expansion to accelerate, but this area is under much speculation. Gravistar formation may provide an alternate explanation for sudden and intense gamma ray bursts throughout space. LIGO's observations of gravitational waves from colliding objects have been found either to not be consistent with the gravistar concept, or to leave the question unanswered. Topic. In comparison with black holes, By taking quantum physics into account, the gravistar hypothesis attempts to resolve contradictions caused by conventional black hole theories. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Event horizons. In a gravistar, the event horizon is not present. The layer of positive pressure fluid would lie just outside the event horizon, being prevented from complete collapse by the inner false vacuum. Due to the absence of an event horizon the time coordinate of the exterior vacuum geometry is everywhere valid. Topic. Dynamic stability of gravistars In 2007, theoretical work indicated that under certain conditions gravistars as well as other alternative black hole models are not stable when they rotate. Theoretical work has also shown that certain rotating gravistars are stable assuming certain angular velocities, shell thicknesses, and compactnesses. It is also possible that some gravistars which are mathematically unstable may be physically stable over cosmological timescales. 
Theoretical support for the feasibility of gravistars does not exclude the existence of black holes as shown in other theoretical studies. See also Acoustic metric Acoustic Hawking radiation from sonic black holes Dark energy star Black star semi-classical gravity Topic References Topic Further reading Topic External links Papers about Gravistars on GRQC